So, Dad, maybe I could mow the lawn. How tall do you like it? This tall? I can mow my own grass, Will. People needn't worry so much. It's not my time yet. This is not how I go. Right. The witch. The witch? There was a woman in the swamp who told him how he'd go. She showed me how my life ends. It doesn't happen like this. So how does it happen? Surprising. Wouldn't want to ruin it for you. And you, well, forget the life you know, because having a kid changes everything. I mean, there's the diapers and the burpings and the midnight feedings. Did he do any of that? No, but I hear it's terrible, just awful. Well, I should probably get dinner started. I, I can, can help. help. No, no, you stay out here and talk. Oh, hey, you come sit with me. So, Dad, maybe I could get the pool pump working if you wanted to swim. Ah, uh, don't put yourself out. It's fine. You know where the chemicals are? I used to do it when you were gone, remember? I was a traveling salesman, Will. I couldn't exactly stay at home. I wasn't trying to pick a fight. Oh, here, you can feel him kick. Oh, he's strong. When's he coming? 22 weeks, so. Five months. Five months? Well, uh, you'll tell him about me. Only the good stuff. Of course. Yeah, Dad, I'd really like to get to know the more real versions of events. Stories. You. Maybe we could go over some things while I'm here. You mean while I'm here? So, I want to know the full history. I knew you grew up in Alabama, but was it here in Montgomery? Uh, not too far away. A tiny little place called Ashton. Our town was so small, the phone book was a yellow page. Our town was so small, the zip code was a fraction. Our town was so small, well, we only had three jokes. But I'll tell you, the best part about growing up in a little place like Ashton, a boy with ambition can be a pretty big deal. Edward Bloom. Don Price. People say, uh, you're going for quarterback. Oh, well, I am. That's my spot. My. Oh, well, then you should have it. What do you mean? Just that. I'm giving you a quarterback. You can't give it to me. It's not yours to give. <laughs> well, then I guess I better win it first. Don't try and outsmart me. Believe me, Don, I'm not trying that hard. Edward Bloom! He's the man I treasure. He's the man I'm wed. Though he doesn't know it yet, he'll be with me. Until we're dead, Jenny Hill no more will be my name. And I've handsome Edward Bloom to blame. Edward Bloom, do you love me like I love you? Well, of course not. You don't? I've heard you say how you love my broad shoulders, strong arms, the <laughs> stubble on my chin. These would be very unattractive on a girl like you. Oh, stop. I dare say I love you in a completely different way than you love me. Oh, nothing will ever come between us. Now calm down, calm down! Man, there's a giant in the hills! I've seen it! He said he's all crazy as a fire! He might eat my kale! <laughs> we, man, we will! Yeah! Now I will have my balls in this town! Not without a permit! I got your permit right here! Yeah. We gotta smash the giant before he smashes us! Yeah! All right, no, we need torches and pitchforks. Wait, wait. Has someone tried talking to this giant? You can't reason with them. He's a monster. Well, I'll do it. I'll go talk to him, see if I can get him to move on. Edward Bloom. Don Price. You want a sweet-talking giant, Bloom? Go right ahead. It'll be your funeral. Now that's just it, Don. The witch. She showed me how my life ends. Doesn't happen like this. Bye, Jenny. <laughs> he loves me. That's my boy.